What's happening, sports fans? How you doing? I am Kendrick, the sports guy. Good day to you. And Olympic gold medalist sprinter Michael Johnson is launching a track league that's looking to get track and field sprinters a little bit more cash. We're going to talk about that in this segment. Make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click that follow button. The legendary sprinter, again, Michael Johnson, who's straight out of Dallas, Texas, with the Dallas skyline. Uh, he is launching a new track league called Grand Slam Track. Uh, that was announced on Tuesday. Uh, it will launch next April with plans for one event in Los Angeles, uh, the home of the 2028 Olympics, and then one in another American city, and then two more overseas. The league also announced that it would sign world record holder Sidney McLaughlin, LeBron, lending star power to this new league, and uh, almost a year before it opens. Again, Johnson, who won uh, Olympic gold at the 1996 uh, Atlanta Olympics in the 200 and 400, he said he's been one of the biggest critics about these track and field athletes not getting compensated, not getting uh, the money that they should deserve. And he was also talking about that he, he would like to see more head-to-head -head matchups between some of the marquee big-name track and field athletes. And he said creating this league will be able to do that. Uh, now, again, track is you know on the odd years you get the world championships then the even years every four years you get the olympics so in between there there's not a lot of of meets and leagues you do have the diamond league which is it happens and by the way the diamond league will no longer be showed on nbc uh they don't have the contract so that kind of hurts track and field exposure but that's the only league where you can accumulate points and then at the end of the season then you get a cash uh prize so, uh, Michael Johnson has been been critical of uh, these track and field athletes not being compensated. I remember uh, I did something a couple of months ago where Sha'Carri Richardson was talking about the same thing. Now, how will this work? Uh, the Grand Slam track plans to sign 48 athletes known as GST racers to contracts, then to use appearance fees to bring another 48 athletes, which would be called Grand Slam track challengers, to each meet. The athletes will be divided into uh, categories. For instance, a short sprint group will run 100 and 200 meters over the course of a weekend, and they will compete for a $100,000 top prize with cash being awarded down to eighth place. So you probably wonder how is the funding? Where is he getting the funding from? Well, according to reports, Johnson uh, has secured more than $30 million in financial commitment, uh, a group called Winners Alliance. Described by the league as Johnson's operating partner, was the lead investor. So again, legendary sprinter Michael Johnson has created this, this, tra this track league for some of the top athletes. So now maybe we can see some of the U.S. sprinters go head to head uh, in, in, these, in these meets rather than we have to wait for either the Olympics or the World Championships to see those type things happen. So I'd like to know what you guys think about this new Grand Slam Track League. Again, it's going to debut next April. Again, April 2025. Right now, they're still working on a television deal with someone, but I, I guarantee somebody hopefully will jump on this. I'd like to know what you think about that. Talk to me in the comments. Uh, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to the channel. I am Kendrick, the sports guy. We will see you on the other side. And on the next report, I am out. Peace.